both jobs. Yeah. You know. Well, I think the biggest thing is, you know, just trying to help help people get what they need to be successful. And uh, as a coach, I mean, I think one of the rewarding things is to try to is to see guys come in here that, um, you know, or maybe a, a hybrid between a a kid and an adult when they get here that leave here as a as a, a, a confident adult ready to go out and, and do great things and watching that sort of transformation process happen um, is rewarding. Um, you know, I think anybody that's in coaching probably enjoys the competitive aspect of, of uh, coaching and, um, you know, uh, having a chance to work as a team for, you know, a common goal. So you're working as a staff and, and then with everybody on your team, everybody trying to accomplish the same thing. Uh, and that sort of team environment is, is something that's kind of hard to find outside of athletics. Um, you know, as an athletic director, really what you're trying to do is to, is to help the various programs in our department access the things that they need to have success. And so then, you know, um, working on that and watching some of those things actually translate into success uh, is rewarding. Oh, if anything, what's the most difficult part about having two jobs? Well, obviously you have to be able to, to balance balance both things and, um, you know, divide your time in a way that doesn't take away from either. So uh, trying to do the job such that the football program is, is uh, as good as we want it to be, um, and at the same time our athletic department department and everybody involved in our athletic department is getting the at attention that they need and deserve. Uh, so I think it's just trying to, you know, divide that time and, um, you know, keep from getting pulled in too many different directions. Uh, how did you end up with football as a primary sport? I know you coached other sports as well. Yeah, you know, as a, as a student athlete, I played football and baseball. And then I went on and started my football career. But in my first job, I, I had a chance to become uh, the head baseball coach, uh, kind of just because of a situation. And I had a baseball background. But, um, you know, football was kind of, you know, where I wanted to be. And uh, so you just kind of pursue opportunities that, that come in that area. And uh, this is how it worked out. And tell me about the one year of coaching that you had with softball. Yeah, well, that was an odd situation, a situation where we had uh, some trouble in our program. And, and uh, at the time, I wasn't the athletic director, and our athletic director knew that I had a background in, in baseball. And so uh, we basically just needed somebody to kind of pull things together and hold things together through the rest of a season. And so uh, I agreed to try to help do that. And, you know, I was really fortunate that we had a great group of people uh, in that program that responded well to uh, the situation and ended up being a really fun and rewarding experience. That's all I got for you. Okay.